The oil state's capital have called on the president, Bola Tunubu led administration, to enact policies that will take more citizens out of poverty. The aggrieved youths carrying various placards and banners made the call when they embarked on a peaceful protest as part of the ongoing nationwide hunger protest. During the protest, they barricaded the Agbawarin or Jaw Road entrance of the nation's premier tertiary institution, the University of Ibadan, decrying the alleged lack of concern to address the earnings of Nigerians as captured in his recent national broadcast, which they said failed to address any of their demands. They promised not to back down from the ongoing nationwide protests and warned for of dire consequences if the prevailing economic hardship persists. We can no longer go to school. We cannot longer. We can no longer afford three square meal a day. Gari is so expensive. Rice is expensive. Beans is expensive. And our president is telling us that all the demands of end bad governance, all the solutions to it is just rice palliative. We are tired of eating rice. Today we gathered here peacefully to start protesting, and we protested peacefully. But we've been protesting peacefully for the past few days. But today, it seems things, things are no more working out as we planned. Based on what happened this morning, that we put um, we put some barricade on the road, and um, it was as if the police people want to come and um, arrest us. But when they came, we need to dialogue with them one on one. But everything went out peacefully. After the media address, Nigeria is even more upset that President Inubu did not even take note of any of the demands of the protesters. But that address proves that the president and his entire executives are not living in the reality of the state they are governing. 